new car new car new car new car so guys year room you guys ready for this face of real i got you guys in one two yo what's going on guys i'm sorry about not actually doing face reveal i'm not gonna do that anytime soon i'm not gonna lie to you guys <laughs> today we got a cool little video that i'm doing it's gonna be a shorter video today so if you guys don't know about a week ago this uh cdl champs pack came out in the store for cod you get a bunch of stickers and emblems and calling cards but you also get this variation of the m4 we got compensator on it we got stock m16 grenadier we got no stock we got stippled grip tape and we have a commando foregrip also very quickly i fucking despise when they put realism ground war in here i swear to god i hate it so goddamn much if you guys don't know what the cdl is it's pretty much the competitive league for call of duty that's where all the pro players are and you know they get paid salary to play this shit so so i kind of trust their opinion when they're like yeah this gun's the gun and i'm telling you guys especially after the mp5 nerf the m4 is actually like one of the best guns in the game Game. I think all the gun recommendations that I've done so far, so like the Uzi, the FAL, and whatnot, I think I've been pretty accurate in literally each one of them. The only reason I'm not getting a shit ton of kills with it right now is because it's fucking realism ground war and nobody wants to play this shit. I can't think of a single person who is like, yo, I really, really, really want to play realism fucking ground war. But regardless, it doesn't really matter. This is going to be a shorter video anyways. This gun is really good in S and D, guys. I highly recommend it. You guys play a lot of domination and ground war and shit like that. This gun is still good. I'm telling you, this shit beams, all right? It's kind of weird because I've been playing with the submachine gun pretty much the entire time I've ever played COD. Like I used the SOG last year. I used the PPSH in the year before, and this year I've been using a shit ton of the MP5 and even the MP7 at times. But this M4, this M4 is no joke. absolutely bodied that kid I desecrated him also guys just so there's no confusion a majority of the time that I'm making these class setup videos it's almost always for multiplayer and CDL I, I really I'm not into making videos on warzone just because I feel like I need to concentrate a little bit more and I'm kind of more of a commentary guy this game is sometimes it's kind of easy to me so I kind of just talk and play at the same time and it really doesn't make a difference to me Brings me to another point, guys. I've been playing a whole shit ton of story games, and as soon as I'm done with the two that I'm playing right now, I'm actually, like, highly considering playing another video game. Not necessarily a playthrough, but I'd be down to play a story game and kind of commentate over it and kind of have some funny moments and shit to say. But they, they'd also be, like, a little bit longer videos. They're not going to be as often as my COD videos. I just sprinkle them in every now and then. So if you guys are interested in that, let me know. Why are you shooting my body? How did he spawn behind me, bro? This game's fucking whack. Oh. My. God. All right, guys. Yeah, uh, realism ground war is in it. I'm getting annoyed. My next video is probably going to be whenever they get rid of realism ground war and put in some good shit. Listen, guys, today's been a very good day. Here's a promise. At 500 subs, I will do a face reveal and it will be magical. Alrighty, guys. If you enjoyed the video today, leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. Leave a comment. See you guys later. Toodaloo.